from you that just arrived from eye catching corals we just wanted to show these off and let you guys know what we do when we get these in um, we do get a monthly shipment from them and we get frags for you guys which are usually an assortment of different things so it's always a surprise for us we never know what we're getting um, unless we order outside of our pack so just to show you guys what we have here Good morning, Isaac. Want to say hello? Saludos desde Phoenix View. Aquí estamos para todos los jovistas latinos que quieran venir a visitarnos. Estamos para ayudarlos. Vengo desde Puerto Rico. Si no saben inglés o quizás tienen algún problema con inglés, aquí les vamos a ayudar en español a que hagan su mejor hobby para todos. That is awesome. I agree with everything he said. That is awesome. <laughs> All right. So you guys know, this is Isaac. He is a wonderful person. He has come to visit us and stay with us hopefully forever. Um, and right now what I have him doing is unboxing all the corals. And what they're doing is inspecting them and making sure they're okay. Because when you ship corals, and especially the way we ship them, this time they came from FedEx. We didn't import them directly on a uh, cargo plane. They do get tossed around and flipped upside down. So some of the corals do get damaged during shipment. They may get broken off a plug and the containers may get cracked, which do happen. So just to let you guys know, we're always trying to improve our shipping methods and these cups tend to cause less harm than some of the other shipping methods. So what's up, Christian? What what's do you up? got for us? Just unpacking the new coral, see what we got. I love the colors, looking good. Stores coming together nice too. Yep, they just hung up these lights this morning. We brought over the Orfix. These things are a beast. We have them over the frag tanks temporarily, and we just put one over the Paladarian up front. Now those lights are just gonna keep us lit until we can get in our new lights um, and our new filtration setup. So we will have these boxes siliconed and these tanks drilled over the next week or two. It's just taking a little bit more time, so I wanted to show you guys and keep you updated. We do plan on giving you daily updates and honestly follow us, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, whatever you can, um, share the word. Oh wait, I forgot this thing's on over here. Look at it, you guys get the witness, it is raining. I love this thing. It makes, <laughs> makes me wanna put misters everywhere. It's just like. It smells so good in there. All right, <laughs> so I let those things run. Um, you guys can check out the lights. They're literally just sitting up there temporary. <laughs> so I am excited to show off this thing as well. Um, so that skimmer, we did finish putting it together and it is inside here. And I did notice a super cool feature of that Reef Octopus skimmer. And then inside the cup, it's got a squeegee to clean the lid. So check this out. If I can lift it up. Actually, you know what? I can't do it one-handed, guys, sorry. But um, if I take this off, that thing is a squeegee. All right. I'm gonna have to cut this part off, because I'm... It's either too brand new or too dry or I can't get it off. Ooh. There we go. Someone's gonna have to. <laughs> All right, I tried to take the cup off for you guys, but literally it was impossible to do one-handed. But <laughs> it does have little wiper blades that clean the neck of the cup and you can spin it. So it is super cool. Um, but I'll show you more about that later on. And this light that I have in my hand, these are these motion sensor charger things. Uh, I'm gonna mount some of these up top underneath just for the canopy. Cause it's like hard to see underneath that sump. You know, it gets dark in here, especially with all this wood, makes it very hard to see. So we are gonna mount LEDs everywhere. 
just because we love LEDs and we love lights, but also because visibility is what we want to offer you guys. You know, when we're doing videos and stuff, I want you to be able to see 100%. You know, what's the point of taking my time to do the video if you guys aren't getting anything from it? So, all right. Now, I don't have a filter on the camera at the moment, guys, so everything may look a little blue to you, but to me, it looks just perfect. Um, I plan on putting on a filter next time, but we just don't have one at the moment, so we just have to see the blue, but we will post more pictures later on. All right, guys, that's just like my 30 second update. Just want to let you know for the morning what's happening. Um, there are still some more corals over here in the cups. We will get these out shortly and we will share them with you. I'm going to try to update inventory as soon as possible and do maybe like an underwater inventory video for you guys. So stay tuned for that. Um, and we will be putting on more products, like I said, by the day. These are our brine shrimp over here that we are currently hatching for the axolotl babies. These things are growing pretty nicely. There's a little one right there. <laughs> but as always, thanks for watching. Happy reefing. Stay tuned for the next one. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend. And thank you for being part of the Coralus community.